Hey guys, it's Jeremy here with Majors Academy Dog Training. And lately we've had some questions about the e-collar. So I want to explain to you a little bit how we use it. So first and foremost, we use the Mini Educator Einstein, and which has a hundred levels. So very sensitive to the dog. And we always strive to work for the lowest level possible. As you can see, this thing goes all the way up to 100. High, 93, that's the high right there. And then it goes down from Honestly, there. if you put it on yourself and put it on 20, you can barely even feel it. I've had it all the way up until about 60 or 70, and it just is a muscle pulse that it gives you. It doesn't hurt you. So I want to show you on Nuka just how fun it can actually be because all we're trying to simulate here is just a tap on the shoulder. So it's not anything that causes them pain or anything. All we want is a reminder of our dogs to uh, break their focus a little bit and have them come when called. Because coming when called is probably one of the most important training skills that you can teach your dog. So the come has to be there. It's a lifesaver. And I'll show you how, I do, how we do it. Let's do it. <clears throat> So there you see how he's kind of just hopping around. I'm pressing the button, I'm telling him to come, and he's just hopping around having a good time. Here we come. Good boy. Sit. Good. Break. One of the other things that makes it really beneficial to have your dog e-collar trained is that you give them the freedom to uh, kind of roam around off leash and know that uh, he stays right by you or he calls, he comes when you call him. So um, properly e-collar trained, it does not hurt your dog at all. It makes them happy to have it on because they have that freedom to roam and do what dogs do. So I'll show you a little bit more work, but uh, so far he's hopping around. And anytime he's changing directions, I'm, I'm sort of pressing the button to get him to come. I don't even have to use the, the command come because he knows what that sensation just means. So, check it out. Come. Oh, boy. Try to see if we can show you a couple more. Come. Good boy, buddy. Good. Yeah, good boy. I'll take that. Good. Good boy. Also, with off-leash healing, it works really well for him. Let's check out his off-leash heal.
break. That's it. Very nice. And the other magical thing is, if you use it consistent enough, you barely even have to press the button because if you, like I said, if you condition them very properly and well, um, they listen right away. So I'm not press, I haven't pressed the button in a while and look at how Nuka just kind of sticks with us. And he also just has the option to go wherever he wants, but uh, he decides to stick with us. So anyway, I just wanted to show a little video of how fun the e-collar can be and how gentle we use it. Dog is not in pain at all and everyone's having a good time because he's off leash he has the, the freedom to do what dogs do and we have the ability to call our dogs when we want them to call so check him out here he decides he wants to stick by us anyway guys we'll catch you later this is jeremy with majors academy dog training we out